patients undergoing um, pretreatment with bevacizumab and a standard chemotherapy, which was either oxaliplatin or irinotecan based, many different regimens were allowed, uh, were randomized by moment of progression. And those who had undergone pretreatment with oxaliplatin, then second line had treatment with irinotecan, vice versa. The randomization was only whether bevacizumab was continued in second line or not. And um, the primary endpoint of this trial was overall survival, and it was uh, met its primary endpoint, so it was statistically and clinically relevant uh, positive trial. Uh, hazard ratio was 0 0.81, and the median progression free survival with chemo alone was 9.8 months, whereas with chemotherapy and bevacizumab, it was 11.2 months. I think Importantly, um, the continuation of bevacizumab did not add toxicity, so there was no additional toxicity um, from the uh, chemotherapy comp uh, when compared to between the treatment arms, and there was no unexpected finding uh, with the continuation of bevacizumab.